Natsura! Megumi-chan! Anyway, you guys, this is a Shiki anime. Well, Shiki TV anime review. Guys, if you have not heard of Shiki TV, check it out. It's an anime. Uh, it's only 26 episodes, and it's a really, really good anime. I want to do a review for this anime, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay. Now, there's two... Well, there's actually three three characters. There's a doctor. There's a, there's another character who's a girl named Migimi-chan. And there's another character with purple hair. His name is Natsuna. Natsuno Yuki. Now, uh, what happens is, how the episode starts off is, uh, Mugumi chan is walking, and she's, she, and she's interacting with the environment. It shows her walking, and, you know, she, um, and she's walking around. She's looking at the environment and everything, and she sees a guy that she likes named Natsuno Yuki. Now, she talks to Natsuno Yuki. Uh, she really likes him, but Natsuno Yuki is kind of a guy who is, you know, he doesn't take he doesn't take attention very well. He just brushes it off. He's like he's like he sees not he sees um Mingi Chan. He's like okay whatever. She's trying to talk to me. I don't care. You know but whatever. Move on to the next girl. So anyway um you know she she still tries to contact him. I mean you know they still try to she still tries to interact every time she sees uh Natsuno. Uh so anyway it, he 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 doesn't show he he doesn't show her attention and. And he still keeps moving on and doing what he has to do. Now, a couple of days later, uh, Mugumi chan dies. And Natsuno's like, how did she die? What happened? How the episode ends off is he you see Mugumi chan going up to Natsuno's window, and you're like, what's going on? Is she is she still alive? And and right after that first episode, everybody starts to die. Every, I mean, well, not everybody, but the but the village starts to slowly die and decrease. And the doctor, who the patients are sent to, they're like, "What's going on? Why is everyone dying in the village?" And they're slowly starting to realize that it, it's either a plague or it's someone who's causing it. And that's later on in the episode. They figure they figure out somebody who causes it. Now, um, they try to take methods to uh, basically. Uh, solve this method. The doctor brings in the patients. He 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 does different therapies and stuff like that that he can use on the patients. It doesn't work. Um, they die anyway. And he's like, and he's getting really stressed out. He's getting really stressed out. And he's saying, I'm done with this. I don't even feel like working on this anymore. So, what happens is the doctor gets his wife, and he learns that his wife is controlled. Uh, he, well, actually, he learns that his wife is bitten by the same play that everybody else is bitten with. So anyway, he does an experiment on the uh, on his wife, and he figures out what's what's going on, how how this is how this is occurring, and he's figured out that somebody is causing this. And um, basically, he figures out what he can do. I think he does some type of blood transfusion, and that's able to nullify the bite that's that's occurred from the uh, the, uh, the 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 other society, which is the vampire slash werewolves. And so he's able to figure this out, and thus he's able to figure out how to defeat these guys. So what he does is he straps them down, and he ends up gnawing the hammer into her heart, and that destroys her. She dies. So it was kind of that part was kind of gruesome, you guys. Uh, I, I was was like, whoa, this is getting sick. Um, and so then they figure that out, and they go on search to take care of these vampires slash humans to take them down um, and, and and one way to take them down is to let them be in sunlight because uh, that because that'll destroy vampires or to stab the stake straight through their heart and that'll destroy them as well too so um, also the van now the vampires let's go to the vampire society now the vampire society one way they can stay alive is they have to drink people's blood so one of Natsuno's best friends uh, Said, "Come to our side because we need you. You are one of the strongest." So, the so his best friend bites him and he becomes infected. Now, this is the crazy part. When you are bitten by the vampire, by by one of these vampires, you still keep your brain and you st and, and and you're still yourself. You're still yourself. And so now you either have a choice to resurrect, or you're gonna die. Most people who are bitten. Most people resurrect. There are some cases when some people die, depending on the circumstance. Now, um, when Natsuno arises, he goes and talks to the doctor, and he says, "Hey, 
this is what we're going to do. We're going to work together to solve this, even if it kills me. We're going to work together to solve this issue because I don't want anybody else to die in the village because it gets to a point where there's only like, maybe like, out of the whole population, there's maybe only like two, 100 people left in the village. That's not a lot from a thousand. So, uh, and they they work towards that and they're able to actually, uh, they're, they're, they're they're able to actually work together and solve, solve an issue, and and it's like they get to this point where it's kind of like the climax where they're like, okay, we get to this point now. What do we do? And there's also the doctor has a best friend and he's a priest. Now he doesn't agree with the method because the the doctor's telling him that we have to come together to to solve this issue. The priest is saying that if I have to take somebody's life. That goes against my belief. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I refuse to do that. So uh, he takes his own path, and he ends up teaming up with the with the sheik. With the uh, they call him the sheiki, I guess. I'm, I'm not. Yeah, they call him the sheiki, and he he teams up with them, and um and the 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 leader of the sheiki persuades him to give him blood every time he needs it. So he takes blood every time he needs it to survive because now he he's special. This guy who is the leader of the Shiki, he is special. He can stay out in the day however long he wants because he has some type of special ability that makes him super strong and he's and he's invincible um, in some cases. Now, uh, let's go ahead and, and, and kind of get, get to the point. Um, so anyway, uh, they figure out a way to uh, kill off all the Shiki and in a, in a, in a final burst of... Uh, in a final burst of... Thought you Natsuno Yuki takes the leader and traps him inside of of a of a pit, and he says, "Well, what are you gonna do with that? You trap me inside of a pit. I'm immortal. You can't take me down. You cannot defeat me. I can get shot." And there's been times when when the leader's been shot five times or six times, and he he has not died. So anyway, traps him in there, and he uses a bomb, and the bomb covers him up. And if he doesn't get blood, he's gonna die. So they both trap. He does a kamikaze effect. Take take. Natsuno Yuki dies, well, supposedly in the anime. Natsuno Yuki dies, and the uh, and 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 also the leader of the Shiki dies as well. So they're trapped inside there, and now the doctor has uh, successfully uh, destroyed all the, uh, the 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 Shiki, and that's basically how the anime ends. Now, um, to get the reason why this anime is so good is because it actually brings it shows you two different societies it shows you the human race and it shows you the people who want to live on longer and 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 and, and it shows you kind of a it's kind of a slippery slope because it's like you have one society that believes they can live off of the other people's blood and it's not that bad because every sin is of its same value and you have the other human race who says that even if it's like that they should not live and they've they've committed a lot of sins, so they should die. And you have the doctor who says that any means necessary, I'm going to take out these shiki. No means necessary. So uh, overall, this anime is a really really good anime. I really suggest you guys checking it out. I really enjoyed it. Um, it's only around 25 or 26 episodes, so you guys would definitely definitely enjoy it. Uh, there's not that many main characters. There's only like three supposedly, and it's about personal preference. There's only three. Uh, characters, uh, Natsuno Yuki, Mikimi Chan, the Doctor, and oh, I guess you can throw in the priest too. Yeah, so that's that's about four. So, excuse me. So overall, uh, it's 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 really 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 good. I, I highly suggest you guys check it out. You guys will enjoy it. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You you guys will draw. I was trying I was trying to think of anything else I need to say to uh you know get, I'll let you guys know. Also, the OST. I was listening to the OST today. And it's really, really good. Um, I think there's a total maybe of 25, 13 uh, OST uh, tracks. So you guys should definitely go and download that. I would play one of them now, but I don't want to get copyright infringements. So, uh, so I'm just leaving with that. Uh, guys, comment, rate, subscribe, and uh, let me know what you think. Um, and if, I, I mean, it's, it's, it's like, and also at one point, um, his uh, Natsuno Yuki's best friend, he gives up. He says, uh, "If I don't want to live this life anymore, if I have to kill off people for my benefits, so I'm just gonna die." Because he didn't want to wake up anyway. He didn't. He didn't. He didn't want to be 
put in the situation he was in anyway. So he was forced. So he, he gave up his life and um, killed himself. Well, not killed himself, but, you know, he, did, he didn't want to live that life anymore. So he uh, uh, pretty much did what he had to do to go to the next life and die in a free will. Um, so, guys, this is the end of this video. I really, really enjoyed making this video. I'm so sorry this video was so long, but I really enjoyed it. I had to make this video. Guys, please leave your comments, rate, and subscribe. And I look forward to checking you guys later. Peace.